Good morning, everyone. Just out here doing some gazing. Looking at the beautiful view. I decided I was going to be a bit more positive. I know that I had said I was going to do a series of the sun and the moon and a little highlight on the planets. I'm going to get back into that. I'm going to get back into those videos and I'm going to dive back and forth. Um, but like I said, this month is important and I really think that we need to pay attention. You know, don't listen to mainstream media, but do listen because they do send and drop clues and stuff that we need to pay attention to, stuff that they think that we're asleep to, we need to pay attention to. I understand that, that you know, there's an election that's coming up here, and there are a lot of people in the truthing community have brought, brought it up about how they are saying that some type of asteroid or meteor or whatever is supposed to pass by or hit there on November 2nd, just convenient, right in time for the elections. And I think um, one of the brothers in the community had brought this up in one of his videos, and I want to give much respect to him. Um, I might shadow his video, ask him if I could, um, because he brought out some interesting points. And I think it's really important that we do pay attention to stuff like this. So, And I apologize if I don't mention your name in the video, but I will try to either put in a clip of your video or at least give a, a link to your description in a link to your excuse me a link to your video in my description so either way I want to send a shout out to you brother um so like I said there's just signs and clues out there that we need to pay attention to you know a lot of us are enlightened a lot of us are very spiritual a lot of us have, have always been on that journey but this is kind of waking us up a little bit and I think that we need to stay focused on that and don't get distracted by the other stuff the other little stuff that doesn't really matter because this is the ultimate goal here is that we have to it's, it's spiritual no matter what and we need to stay focused and we need to keep on doing that people just stay focused just keep on doing what you do just keep on being yourself number one don't let any, anybody change you don't let anybody change your mind and just keep keep the strength all right i'm gonna let this clip play and like i said i'll try to rem remember to drop a link in my description for this channel that's coming on so these these articles are misleading they're not really telling you what's going on they're just trying to warn everybody else what time it is the people who know about you know these articles and stuff which happens to be your zionist jews your freemasons and all they know these codes that the articles release so that's how they you know communicate okay so on november 2nd a huge asteroid is supposed to come down. Remember, it's not really an asteroid. It's celestial energy. The heavenly realm, 5D, whatever you want to call it, uh, gamma ray radiation, whatever you want to call it, is coming down and it's going to crash. And expect a very big false flag event on November 2nd, where there, what, there might not be an election, okay? So, you know... Uh, we might not have a winner this year. <laughs> you feel me? And, you know, that's basically my prediction. That's all I want. I wanted to add this. Why? Well, I feel it's important that I explain this um, about the asteroid. Um, if many of you already know about it, um, I'm just going to just real go over this so you understand where I'm going out with this, with this epiphany. Um, election Eve, the asteroid may be heading towards Earth. 
So they're telling us don't panic, but this is going to be on the night or the night before the election. So as the brother put it in the video before, they are passing messages back and forth. And this is coding um, that, you know, that's out there. It is something on a higher plane. It is something celestial that is going on. It's something spiritual that's going on. Those um, who have that third eye um, and have that discernment, we can figure it out. And I think that's why we're moving along as fast as we are. And I think that's why this is making more sense to us. And I think that we are coming amongst one another. You know, you know, the saying um, that we know each other's by that we know each other by our fruits or something along that line. Um, and I think that the ones that are the true ones, we, we are coming, we're, it's coming clear to us. And the ones that were not the true ones, I think they're kind of fading to the back, you know. There's some truth seekers out there that say they speak the truth, but they kind of faded to the back or, you know, their, their voice is not as loud anymore. Or you just, what's coming out their mouth is garbage and it, it's more of a distraction than it is, it is a truth, you know, but here we are, we got a, a few weeks now. And I'm just talking about everything that's going on in the world here. Um, but if you, if y'all are not aware of, of what's going on, you might think I'm a crazy person. But those who know, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Um, the asteroids. Has anyone actually seen an asteroid? Or a meteor? Or is it safe to say they are the same thing? Because I really have not made a clarification if those are actually the same thing. You know, I don't want to sound like I don't know what I'm talking about. But I actually don't know if a meteor and an asteroid is the same thing. So maybe somebody could drop a comment and explain to me if it is the same thing or if it's along the line, along the line, if it's just space junk, you know, all the same, I guess. But I just want to just make this clear. Um, I don't want anybody to be fearful. That is what they do. And, you know, nobody's really talking about this, you know. I heard a few podcasts talk about it, but it was just a, you know, just a dabble in it because, you know, we all know that it's the eve of the election night, kind of odd how an asteroid is going to hit the earth or pass by the earth, you know, the eve, you know, and so that's going to make a great concern, you know, is that going to prevent a whole election from happening? Well, might be so, you know, who is to say, you know, these are all just my opinions. And then there's also other, you know, viewers opinions may agree with my opinion as well. But as I say, um, I am a truth seeker. I enjoy listening to other truth seekers and I enjoy researching the truth. Because, you know, as we know it, everything to this point, we have been lied to. It's been proven that we've been lied to. It's been debunked to and from how we've been lied to. So, I bring that up to say this. I was actually asked the question tonight. What am I going to do about it? Well, my answer is this. 
because I actually didn't get a chance to answer that question that that person asked. And that is, keep on standing up for your rights. Keep on understanding that you are a human and you have rights. Keep on understanding and gaining the knowledge that you have been hidden or you have been lied to. Go seek all the truth and dissolve the lies. And I'm talking, well, actually disregard the lies. Basically, just forget about everything you, that you were ever taught, everything that you were ever learned. Just forget about it. Okay? Um, I'm sorry for this being another long-winded video. As always, I always say stay safe and stay strong. And thank you all my, su my subscribers out there. Thank you for all my new subs. Continue everyone, you know, to show support and show love. Not just to me, but other truthers out there. The real truthers. Okay? We need all the support. And I'm talking about as far as supporting the content and, and just sending a shout out. I'm not talking about any type of monetary or anything like that because I would never ever ask a dime from anybody um, that's not I've already stated it before that's not what this channel is about it's never what it it's been about and it's never what it's ever going to be about um the truth is free basically all right y'all stay safe and stay strong and thanks for watching Thank you.